Hi, this is Amy, and today I want to show you how to take a folder full of documents and print the whole folder. Uh, this tutorial is specific to Mac. You can do something similar on PC, um, and I'll try to remember to tell you those steps when we get there. So we're going to start out with a folder of assignments in Classroom inside our Google Drive, and obviously this will work with any folder of materials, you know, anywhere. Just a couple more steps from Google Classroom. So this is an assignment, and we're going to come into Classroom, and we're going to download the folder. Now, I've already done this before, so when I minimize and open my Finder, then you'll see I actually already have that folder there. And it's in the downloads folder and here it is so it's going to come down as a zip file and you're going to double click it and choose to extract it actually you don't even have to click anything on a Mac it just extracts automatically and so you can see I just did it again and I have uh, two folders there now but they're they're the same you know the same thing so when I open this up I see all of my files inside that I want to print so the next step is I'm going to go into my system preferences and I'll open up my printers and scanners and find the printer that I want to use. So this one's actually offline because I don't actually want to print all 36 of these documents right now, but it'll work the same way even though my documents aren't actually going to come out of the printer. So you can see it down here on my desktop hopefully. And what I'm going to do now is choose the files that I want to print. So for this example, I'm not going to uh, put in all of them because I'll have to cancel every single one of them. But let's pretend I just want to print these files. I'm going to select those and I'm going to drag and drop them to my printer. So you can see now that these documents are in my file list. Uh, you might want to be careful depending on how much RAM you have on your computer with doing that because it is going to access Microsoft Word or whatever software you have that's going to need to open and read those files, you know, that many times. So if I really am printing 36 documents, it's going to open it up, you know, and probably take up a lot of a lot of memory on your computer. So maybe break them into chunks, but you know, who knows? I think what I'd do is just try them all at one time, and if it failed, then I'd try them in smaller batches. Um, hopefully that works for you. It, it certainly appears like it would work. And uh, while I'm not a fan of printing, sometimes you have to print stuff out. And that will make your process a whole lot easier, I hope. So if it helps you, let me know in the comments. Give me a thumbs up and I'd appreciate hearing from you. Thanks and have a great day. Bye-bye.